Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. This video was going to be just a basic vlog um, of my day today. As you can hear in the background, or probably you can see by how everything is lit in my room, it is currently raining. Um, yeah, this weather... This weather has been like really, really weird lately. It's been like raining really hard and then it was just stopping. It's supposed to be sunny and I was going to film an unboxing for my channel, but I said, you know what, I might as well just do a vlog. Um, yeah, so before I get into it, make sure you guys go down below, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button as well, and leave any questions or comments or concerns if you have any down below. So I am actually waiting for a package. I have one more package that I'm waiting for um, from Urban. And then I'm gonna show you guys like what I got. But I basically haven't really been doing anything. Um, I like wrote out some stuff. Oh, I almost spilled my coffee on my bed. I actually like wrote out some stuff that like I've been wanting to plan. I started getting into writing down things that I would have to do for the day on here. And in this book here, I had just put this sticker on here. But this book here, I usually have like a lot of stuff that I want to get done because it helps me keep myself organized. Uh, but if you guys like have problems with like organizing your thoughts or your days and stuff like that, especially if you're a freelancer or just a busy person in, like in general, um, I would suggest getting a, a book and a notepad to be able to write things down and just to keep track of your day and get things done in a more um, in a more organized way because yeah. But majority of my day today has to do with me um, shooting and filming and this weather is just really not it and because i don't have like the lighting source i actually do like to prefer to use like regular lighting um yeah i can't do anything like i'm i have to shoot these photos for like this brand because they had sent me um let me show you guys sorry if it gets dark really quick they had sent me a like it was kind of it's sort of kind of like a jacket but it's not here let me flip it. hold on so they sent me this and it's pretty dope like i really really do like it like especially this this is everything um, so if I like pop the collar and someone behind me, they'll be able to see it. But the front of it is not only the thing that's dope about it, but like, I can't wait to wear this again. So they sent me that and they also sent me these flip flops here. Um, I know I have a lot of like house shoes, but yeah. They sent me these, and I haven't got a chance to wear them yet. Um, they're pretty comfortable when I try them on. Like, this part right here is really thick. So, I have to take those photos for them and send those over to them for their Instagram account. But I don't want to take it in this bad lighting, so hopefully I'll be able to get that done. And then yesterday, I got into, like, this big um, dispute with, like, PayPal because I had sold, um, I had I used to own like Supreme bags, like when I first started getting started in fashion, like really into it and like buying things that I wanted. Um, and I kind of got out of like that hype beast mode. So I was selling my bags and it was actually the, I forgot what drop it was, but it was a black cross body bag and it has like the bold Supreme on the, the fanny pack. And I had sold it to him, to a guy on grailed and he got the bag and then he i guess like i just like okay whatever i didn't really pay attention to it because i just wanted to get rid of it so i had went out and then i just didn't pay attention to my grailed account anymore and i think i had wiped my phone i have a problem with doing that i'll just like erase everything out of my phone just like get like a, a brand new start because i feel like i get like clustered and stuff like that 
So when I did that, I lost track of like the just basically whatever what what was going on. So come to find out, he had put in a dispute that he quote unquote never received the item, and I didn't even get like emails or anything about that. So I just was I didn't know any of this was going on. So he basically won a dispute because I never responded, which makes sense. Um, Cause I guess they thought I was just avoiding it, but I didn't know anything about it. So when I spoke to them yesterday about it, they was like, yeah, like we tried to reach you, but um, you never replied. So we moved it over into his favor. So I was like, one, that's stupid, but whatever. So I sold it back for $140. So I basically yesterday had to pay PayPal. A hundred and thirty dollars because they took off like the fee or something like that but basically the man got away with my bag and the money i said you know what i'm just gonna get it over with it's whatever um just bite the bullet because i also work for fireworks so i get paid through paypal on there so paypal had locked down my account and it's been locked down for about like four months now and i couldn't i couldn't access like any of my money so I just was like, you know what, whatever, just take your money and just unlock my account. Like, cause it's ridiculous. And the crazy thing is it was from an old PayPal account. Like I wasn't really even using PayPal around then. I only made the PayPal account just to sell the bag because Grail told me that I needed a PayPal account and that was it. So I did that. <sighs> so that's how my day went yesterday. But then as soon as I finished paying, see, this is the crazy thing, how God works. I paid them the money. And then as soon as I hung up, I went downstairs to talk to my mom about it. Because my mom was my manager. So I went downstairs to talk to my mom about it. And she just, she wasn't happy about it either. But she was like, okay, well, at least you just got it over with. And everything is fine. And then a knock is at the door. And then my packages came from Urban. And that stuff wasn't supposed to come till today. And the, the package that's come today wasn't supposed to come till tomorrow. So I guess everything got like fast tracked forward. I guess just just for I don't know. I'm just gonna look at it as a blessing. So yeah, that's how that's going. But yeah, I'm actually just sitting here watching a bunch of vlogs, drinking my coffee, writing down some ideas and aspirations and stuff like that. So until my package comes and hopefully when the weather is nice i will be back here to do a unboxing well uh pickups and stuff like that to show you guys like what i got so yeah i'll see you guys later so i just finished picking up my niece from school give me a second okay so Jesus Christ. I just finished pick. The room is a mess. Okay, so I just finished picking up my niece from school and I got the package. So as you seen like in that um the clip right before I had cut it, it was um this green vest that I had on, and that was the vest that I had gotten from Urban Outfitters. They was having a sale for 40% off, and then I had a coupon for I believe was it five dollars off? Yeah. So um I paid $10 for this, and this was originally $60, so major steal. Let's try it on so you guys can see it. This is just it right here. Hopefully you guys can see it. So I got that and I'm really like satisfied just with that alone. And then I got this hat as well. Um, I paid, was it? I didn't really pay that much for this either. I think probably like $5 for it and I think it was like $10. So 
got that and then I got something else that's in there but before I get into there um, I just ordered just a basic essential sweatshirt from Hanes on Amazon Prime just a marble sweatshirt um, just to add on to the cozy feels because it is getting cold here it may be very sunny but usually like on days when it rains like this also it's really sunny out side note let me show you guys look at how sunny it's gotten outside bipolar weather i tell you yeah but so yeah um so by the way this video is not sponsored at all by nothing or no one so yeah but some of these products in here are sponsored but this video is not sponsored what did that whatever um i also got this new man sweater from this brand called new man clothing they had reached out to me and they were willing to send me something from their site um because they're having another product launch in january but they want to send me something now to see like how i can get a feel of their products and they sent me this i had picked this out actually and this is by far the softest sweater that i have i got it in a large so that way it could be like an oversized feel and it could be really cozy and this is a lot softer than the sweaters that I currently own. So I am pretty excited about having that in there. And then you've seen the other two new things that I had gotten as well. Now it's time for the unboxing of this bag. This bag, I don't even know how much, I forgot how much it was. Um, I don't even have my cutter around. So... We're most likely going to cut out how long it takes for me to open this. Okay. So... No, that's the packing maybe. Oh, wow. Oh, this is heavy. Jesus. This thing is heavy. Okay, this is just an empty box. So, this is the bag. I have to look on this site and see how much. Because I believe this bag is probably, like, I don't know. I think it's $20, and I didn't pay that much for it. But, whoa. This is heavy duty seriousness. Um, this is the bag. You hear that? Oh my goodness, I love it. And then the fact that this is not, like, cheap, you can hear it, like, wow. Um, though this bag was not expensive, and even though I did get it for a lesser price, the quality of this bag is really, really good. So, try it on. Okay, let's adjust it first. Calm down, Jerome. Calm down. Oh, there's so many like straps on this thing. This is nice, really nice, and it's heavy duty. And then also, I can wear the bag sort of kind of like, um, like a, just like a regular, I like to carry my messenger bag sometimes like this, so I'll probably just tighten it and wear it like that, or just over my shoulder like this. And this works perfectly fine. I don't even care that it, if it does come across as looking like a pocketbook, but just look at that. Wow, what's inside? Okay. Oh, there's a, also a pocket inside as well. This bag is really, really big. Really, really, really big. Take these out. The front. And I could tell I'll be able to put this in the washer as well. Do look just looking at the fabric. Okay. Wow, this is dope. 
really excited for this so I could wear like this with like a utilitarian look. And it would look really, really nice. And that's the back of it. Pretty dope. So yeah, um, that wraps up the haul and the unboxing haul. That bag, once again, was from Urban Outfitters. The sweatshirt, the bag, the vest, and the hat was from Urban Outfitters. The Marvel sweatshirt was from Amazon and is from Hanes. And the new men sweatshirt was from new men, of course. And I told you guys where the jacket and the slippers were from. Um, I'm going to be tagging everything down below so you'll be able to get it. Hopefully, you'll be able to get these pieces from Urban Outfitters. I will try to find alternatives and link them down there. So that way, you'll like get like a gist of what you want. But it is good to shop on that site. Um, one, to sign up for the rewards program because it gives you... Send you coupons in your email for like 15% off extra on top of the sales that they be having. Like they just had two sales. It was for the best time to shop is for the sales because they had one that was for 50% off of sale items and then 40% off. No, it was 40% off and then the 50% off. But the 50% off was still going and then the 40% off had ended right after the 50% off. Because as I was even trying to check out with more items than this, my items were literally being taken like out of my cart because people were buying them so fast. So that is the best way to shop on Urban Outfit. It was another thing that I wanted to talk to you guys about and that was just basically... I'm like at like a point in being a creator where it's like kind of like a dry spot you know i don't know if it has to do with like mercury getting ready to go into retrograde but um or if like maybe this is just like a step back for me to like you know slow down because i've been like really like gliding pretty fast so um sometimes you gotta get yourself out of a rut and i decided that i was going to treat myself to some nice things because I feel like I've really worked really, really hard so far this year and throughout the past couple of months. Um, and I, as you guys have seen in my last video, if you watched it, I deal with a lot of anxiety and sometimes depression as I used to be depressed, but it comes back every now and again, but just working and I just try to focus more so on my work than having any sit down time by myself, which is why I told you guys I went into the minimalistic thing where it's like I have a like a routine and a schedule and not really having too many things around me because I feel like it would clutter my brain. So yeah, but uh, that's why also the journal helps me a lot because it helps me like put down my thoughts and get them out of my head because then I'll just keep rethinking them over and over and then stressing over them rather than, you know, working hard to accomplish the things that I think about. So it is okay sometimes to hit a rut or um, to slow down because you don't want to burn out. And I feel like I was almost at that point, but sometimes you really have to sit back and reflect on moments like this. So yeah, with that being said, um, I have to clean my room and hang this stuff up and then put these packaging stuff downstairs because my room is literally a freaking mess right now. So, I don't know if I'm going to show you guys, but if I do, I do. If I don't, I don't. So guys, finally my room is back clean, <laughs> I guess. But yeah, um, hmm. I really do like staying in my clothing rack. It just looks so full. I never would have thought that I would have owned this many clothes, but I am fortunate to be having the job that I am having. But I'm just gonna enjoy the rest of this day and well I'm gonna enjoy the rest of the sun while it's out now I'm I actually have to check my PayPal to see if it's working and if not and then I have a new debit card that I had I had created a savings account so I am proud of that I'm gonna start saving and I I did start investing 
with acorns. So that way, you know, when you get older, you have something to look forward to. So I'm going to finish taking care of some more. I actually, oh, I thought that was just it. I have to film five videos for firework because I have been pretty lazy and slacking. So I'll film those and then I'll just slap them across the screen and you guys will see them. And then, then I'll see you guys after that. Guys, um, remember earlier I showed you guys this bag? So while I was inside of it, I had found the tag and I don't know if I did tell you guys the price, but well, this is playing in the background, I was watching David Dobrik. But this bag was originally $45. And I literally only paid a dollar for it. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. Well, it is later and the day has gotten me caught up well, with a nap and watching TV. And I'm waiting to eat right now. So while I was editing, while waiting, I decided I was going to end the vlog off here. So I hope you guys did enjoy this vlog. And if you did, go down below, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button as well. And go down and leave any questions, comments, or concerns if you have any. So we can go to my Instagram. You can feel free to DM me anything and I'll be willing to answer you guys on there as well. So until next time, guys, I'll see you guys in my next one. Later, guys.